It'll be third down and nine for Our Lady of Good Counsel. And if you want to win this ball game tonight, Scott, head coach Andrew Stefanelli and head coach Pat Ward are both trying to avoid the situation that the Falcons are in right now. Third and long, third and nine, third and eight. It was making it much more difficult for the offenses to continue on the drive. Let's see if they're successful here. All right, a good counsel with the ball. A little pass. That's in the left line. That's a completion. And that will go all the way inside the 40, all the way down to about the 46. Jones, Jones. Billy Jones. Ball started out with the 36 yard line. Shamar McIntosh. Good counsel. Who does have a choice? They're going for it here on fourth and two. Fourth and two at the 27. Give to Jones, and Jones, he's good for two, he's good for more, he's inside the 10, and he will finally be out of bounds near the five. Going back here to Olney, Maryland, here at the campus, beautiful campus of Our Lady of Good Counsel. The Falcons, the host team, taking on the cadets of St. John's. They kind of flip-flop in the rankings as St. John's fell to number 77, Our Lady of Good Counsel. Well, they raised up to number 39. And here's Frankie Weaver throwing on the right side. That is incomplete on fourth down. And St. John's has held. For Elijah Moore. Tried to get it to Elijah Moore. He's covered Couldn't by Montana Wheaton on the play. It'll be first and ten. Good It's a pass by Slade. Little completion. That goes to the right side. And... That will be Ojegbe, and Ojegbe lose the ball, and good counsel recovers. Recovered by the Falcons. And he just had so much room that he was not able to fully get out of bounds on that one. The ball, as you can see right here, Scott, he keeps on going, and he makes a move, and just one little tap, one little tap by Delane Oh, excuse me, but he the lane. That's what happened, and now the Falcons get the ball back after turning it over. Second and six, and this is Jones, like a burst of lightning, and Jones will get near the five, maybe the four. So here we go, fourth and goal at the two. And the give goes, I believe that is the fullback and he's going to be stopped near the one Jones it was the jones that was jones actually i thought it was the bigger guy but jones stopped at the one another stop on downs for st john so in the first quarter we've seen one turnover by fumble and two turnover on downs as you mentioned before scott both of these defenses very stingy not giving up any They're easy saying points. that it was good council ball and we're going with what they say and here comes a big time run as it will get to about the 11 yard line. Kamari Randall just burst out and like a bolt of lightning. Lightning is right about that. Randall, as you can see right here, after the handoff, he finds the hole and he gets acceleration right there past the middle linebacker. And man, that young student athlete is swift. No, you're not kidding about that. Swift. Ryan Capriati. The kicking unit. Capriati coming goal. in to kick a 25-yard field goal. It is up, and it is good. 25-yarder, 9.22 to go here in the first quarter. And it is Our Lady of Good Counsel breaking the scoreless deadlock. It is Our Lady of Good Counsel 3 and St. John's nothing on Flow Football. Same play, different result. And different result indeed. As there it goes to Moore, and Moore's got the speed to burn, and he is inside the 30, all the way to about the 27. The biggest play from scrimmage from the Falcons, the same exact play, a nice pitch route on there. He was wide open, and then he goes, big play, 39 yards for this Falcons offense. They've got some steam right now, Scott. Yeah, again, that was a good flare on the pass by Weaver, but more. This guy's got breakaway speed, and he's also very physical. And he's a guy who can take it through the house at all times. 39 yards on that gain. First and 10 at the 28. 
And there's a burst of lightning for Dylan Jones, and Dylan Jones towards the goal line, and he is into the end zone for six. Touchdown, good counsel. Wow, Jones shot out of a cannon there. You didn't even see him for a second. He breaks the first level, second level, and he just runs for 28 yards on that one. A huge play, and now the Falcons got some points on the board. And Dylan Jones... Just got those afterburners going, and man, he has speed to burn. Nine carries, 74 yards, and a touchdown so far tonight. And that one a big one as the point after is up and Second good. And French back to pass, French maneuvering. French rolls out to his right. He's going to fake, and he will be down at the 29 for a loss. A sack. Aaron Childs on the sack and man you talk about a guy with a lot of speed and a guy we already saw him how he can hit but watch his play is, two yards, he didn't go for the down. fake he went for the nice tackle at the waist and got his man i mean and that was his first read weaver saw the the streak the read on that one was a streak just a little bit out too far on that one and now Jones. Jones again. Jones down the right sideline. He may go and he makes a nice break and finally down near the three. A 39 yard run on that one. <laughs> My goodness. Jones has just been getting big play after big play. He just found that hole and got the afterburners going. Marquez and I thought he was going to break it. Excuse me, a 52 yard run. They didn't quite break it for a touchdown when I say break it, but he broke it indeed as 52 yards for Jones and the unofficial stats on him. He's at 143 yards now. Wow. On 14 carries. You're right about that. Back to Jones. Jones again towards the end zone and he is in touchdown. Our Lady of Good Counsel. And Jones, same play, same result. Gets the carry, and he gets to hear his name being called. I mean, after that big run, you got to give it to Jones once again. Flag after the play. Touchdown is good. So Riggs was banged up last week and just motored his way through it. He can run, he played the Wildcat. He finished the game at quarterback, but slayed back from injury. The quarterback wearing those, I don't know if you call them orange or pink or what the color is. He's on the run to the right. He's gonna keep the ball and he will be hit hard out of bounds towards the St. John sidelines. As he got hit in bounds, got knocked out of bounds. So that was a clean hit. And man, he was hit hard. We've got a member of the officiating crew Aaron up here. And, you know, that was absolutely a, a clean hit by Aaron Childs. You know, I talked about one guy laying the wood. How about Childs? And that hit was just an absolute boom on the play there. Uh, you just hate to see it, especially that is just the only downside, one of the few downsides of being a mobile quarterback. He was inbounds, as we said, but he took that hit like a champ, popped right back up, and, um, I mean, that was a clean hit. Well, they ended up calling a blow to the head. And this Falcons team coming up off of a 39 to nothing victory, picking up right where they left off last week. I mean, you just can't say enough about how well they improved after their first couple drives. Yeah, that was against Bishop McNamara. And that is a pick. Forty-one yard line picked off. Mason How about Smith, that? Mason Smith on the pick. Look at the pressure here. French had no chance. The linebacker Smith with the good hands there. And this one is just really, really setting in for the Falcons. Moore on the sideline. 
French tipped, and that's up for grabs. And did they get it? Yes, they did. That's an interception. And that is down to about the 16. Picked off beautifully by Dylan Gooden. Ball is tipped, and then Dylan Gooden picked it off. So back-to-back -back interceptions we've seen here. Let's see if the Falcons can put some points on the board after the consecutive turnovers. We saw one punt, but I mean, talk about the presence of mind from the defense, not only smacking the ball into the air, but it was a one-handed catch on that interception. Yeah, well, Coach Stefanelli told me he transitioned from defensive end to outside linebacker after going from offense to defensive end to fill his skill set. His skill set is being a ball hawk, and he got the tip and ran with it after. Jones the carry, breaks to his right, and he is in, touchdown. Touchdown, good counsel, Dylan Jones. That's a hat trick for Jones, and hats off to that young man. We can't say enough about him, Scott. Why not continue to go to your workhorse there? That's exactly what they do, and they get six more on the board. Dylan Jones just using his vertical talent and he brought a defender into the end zone, Trent Brown. And what a night for Dylan Jones. Has, wow, that looks cool also. I mean, we're talking about video games number here, 20 something carries, three touchdowns. And he's on pace for 220 yards. Kick is up by Capriati and good. 2.46 to go in the third quarter. It is Our Lady of Good Counsel, 24. St. John's College, nothing. Go to Jones, Jamari, or Randall. You, you've got to gotta start thinking about. That goes down the right side, and that is a good game. Moore on the reception. And, you know, you get him out in the open field and it's almost lights out, but they caught him, but not until that was a big gain. And a huge gain there for the, the Falcons. First and 10 Falcons. 34 yards on that pass. 